DJI recently announced the launch of the survey-grade drone of the Mavic 3, the Mavic 3 Enterprise. I'm Andy with Propeller. Let's check it out. Propeller is proud to announce that you will be able to use this drone for your surveys with our PPK workflow. This drone can conduct worksite surveys by creating highly accurate survey data used to measure earthwork progress on your job site. We also want to share some noticeable differences between this drone and the Phantom 4 RTK. First, let's take a look at the body of the M3E. As you can tell, it has foldable arms like DJI's survey grade Matrice 300 and many of their cinematic and hobbyist drones, whereas the P4R has a fixed structure. This makes it easier to transport from site to site. However, when the arms are unfolded, it has a similar wingspan to the Phantom 4. The drone's color also allows for it to be more visible against clouds and blue sky. But keep in mind, the smaller size can still make it difficult to keep visual line of sight. Installing the propellers is very similar to the Phantom 4. You place the propellers on the motors with the corresponding colors. Black goes with black and gray goes with gray. Please note that you will be twisting either clockwise or counterclockwise depending on which propeller you are installing. To remove the propellers, simply press down and twist in the opposite direction. The P4R has a high accuracy RTK module, which is key in allowing us to develop the accurate propeller PPK workflow for mainstream use. The Mavic 3 has a detachable RTK module that connects with a built-in USB-C. To ensure that it is affixed properly, tighten down the bolts by hand. Ensure that the port is free of dirt and debris with compressed air or microfiber cloth before installing. You don't have to detach the propellers and RTK module every time you put the drone away. It's your preference. Much like the P4R, the M3E has the battery installed in the back of the drone. This is also where you can find the drone's serial number. The battery allows for 25 to 30 minutes of flight time with the M3E, whereas the Phantom 4 is 15 to 20 minutes. Please take into consideration that the flight time may be affected by weather, altitude, speed, and the drone's payload. You may have already noticed that the camera is much bigger on the M3E. The reason for this is the Hasselblad L2D 20C camera system which is equipped with two cameras, the first being a 4 3rd CMOS Hasselblad camera with adjustable aperture, and the other a 12 megapixel telephoto camera. The larger sensor on the Mavic 3 allows for clearer images at lower light settings, whereas the Phantom 4 has a 1 inch sensor. The M3E's camera has a mechanical shutter that captures 20 megapixel images, an adjustable aperture, a digital zoom, and the equivalent of a 24 millimeter focal length. With these extremely powerful and compact cameras, they allow the drone to capture survey grade images as the drone reaches a survey speed of up to 30 miles per hour. The M3E remote controller runs off DJI Pilot 2, much like the M300. DJI Pilot 2 is DJI's most advanced mission planning yet. We have found that the error messages are clear, mission planning is more streamlined, and the controller itself is more ergonomic. The drone transmits the live feed video at 1080 at 60 frames per second up to about nine miles away. In comparison, the Phantom 4 transmits up to four miles away. Please be sure to keep the drone within visual line of sight when flying. Among the safety upgrades of this drone are the omnidirectional sensors. These allow for increased obstacle avoidance. The Phantom 4 only has forward, backwards, left, right, and downward sensors. Additionally, the advanced return to home feature allows for the M3E to automatically determine the most optimal route back to its home point, avoiding obstacles, geozones, and executing the path quickly. We at Propeller are excited to have the Mavic 3 Enterprise integrated into our PPK workflow. We will continue to share our learnings as we become more familiar with this drone. Thanks for watching. For more information, please see our knowledge base at help.propellerarrow.com.